Hi, welcome to my channel. I need to convert a F3D file to an STL file, that's Sierra Tango Lima file, for my case that I plan to make for this M17 module. I've got the file here, which is a named R01D F3D. So I've got the file saved. I want to use it with Cura, so I can eventually start you know, printing from uh, one of my devices. So the first thing I've done is got the free trial of 360, which is this program here. 30 day free trial, perfect. So I'm gonna, I've already downloaded that and I've got that open in this window here, as you can see. So all I found that I have to do is go file, open the, and then go to my computer and actually open, if I go to my downloads, the F3D file. Um, so I think that's put it here, double click and it opens it up, which is great. And then all I had to do was go open, then export. I think I'll save it first. Save it somewhere, just so I've got it. And I go file, export. And I want to export it as a STL file. Now you do get a choice here, look. Okay, you get all these choices. But I want the STL. And I'm going to click export. And then it gives you, you know, it takes a minute and it will export it. You can see I've been practicing. So it does work. Just going to wait for that. And then you'll see that now I am able to go to Cura and open that file that it's exported. Hopefully I've already exported one. So we're going to go. It's a new project already. We're going to go open file. And there's the STL there. It wasn't before, it was F3D. Double click. And look, and there it is. The highlighted er areas indicate either missing or extraneous services. Fix your model and open it again. So of course, I'm brand new to this. I haven't got, you know, I've never, I've never sliced before. But to me, this was like quite a big step. I had to get to the point where I could just convert from an F3D to an STL, Sierra Tango Lima. So hopefully this will help you and I'll put the link in for the free trial. Thanks very much for watching. Bye for now.